Hey guys, Braden here with ATT. I don't have a lot of time, so if you want this full version of the Awesome Pottery Trap, you can just head to patreon.com slash Podcast. We need this support. The support helps the show tremendously. You've got two ways to support Patreon or Supercast, or you can just top up the beer coffers by scanning that code and sending us some beer money. Anyways, I hope you enjoy our Awesome Pottery Cap and think about supporting the show. Thanks, guys. Enjoy. Sam on Discord said he would take us to the Texas gun range. Oh, fucking, this guy's a beauty. And I, I, I didn't, he said in the chat, I didn't realize his first encounter with us, we're all shirtless. Yeah, Sitting, glistening shirtless. Glistening. Boys. Just yeah. a little sun. Guts out, just like, just so hungover, sweating. He pulls in um, with just a fucking arsenal. Yeah, so Uncle Slam picks us up. He was so kind as to pick us up. Legend. Drove us a fucking hour out of town. Well, first he drove garage. out of his way from like San Antonio somewhere close outside of it just outside maybe drove all the way up to austin picked us up drove us out to the gun range and after the gun range drove us back and then drove home what yeah. a big day for him that's a big same. day for him but god damn that was a fun gun oh, range so to get there wild dude we went to lone uh, star gun range which was like 40 minutes outside austin and that we're now we're in texas oh, now yeah, now it felt like we're in texas oh yeah oh yeah um we get there I was looking the part, boys. I mean, I had the, I had the fucking you had the cowboy kickers. boots on. They didn't even look funny. I looked like I was fucking. You look, Texas. you like, you look like you belonged there. Until you, um, until you spoke. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> then uh, they're like, "Yeah, this guy's definitely a liberal cuck." <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> the, uh, you know, we got we we rented a twenty two because they had a twenty two steel. Steel shot, steel range, yeah. Uh, steel range, so that was cool. And these guys beside us were shooting, like, s- souped up guns. guns, space guns. They were shooting Call space of Duty guns. guns, but they were twenty twos. So With I just suppressors, and I just kind of wandered over. I was like, "What's up, guys? Like, what are you guys shooting?" They're like, "Oh, this fucking thing's a such and such, such and such tactical stock suppressed red dot sight, blah blah blah." I was like, "Awesome." He's like, "You want to shoot it?" I was like, "Yes." I would Fuck like yeah. to. I would love to shoot that gun. It was like a fucking pistol with a suppressor with subsonic sonic ammunition. So it was like zero recoil, and it didn't make it didn't crack. It just sounded like almost like a PB, BB gun, but it was, pew, 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 but it pew, felt pew, it felt pew, so pew, cool to shoot. It was pew 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 pew. pew, pew. pew. But the, we did rent the thirty or the. Lever. I will. I will say that with that fucking twenty two we were shooting. I didn't know what the fuck I was doing, and I was hitting fucking metal. He's a natural. We yeah He's rented a, a lever action, uh, twenty two held like I don't know fifteen rounds or something. So we we warmed up with that one. Started on the steel range, took a few videos. Rad, dude. Looks like a natural out there. Really? Yeah. I hit the photo one too. Can you believe if that this guy paid a doctor to have better vision? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm wrecking this. This sucks. Here, you take over. I can't get it to like zoom in on it. It's like angled. Oh, like that. I need the bigger target. And 
then we walk back to the truck. Uncle Can't Slam read. opens the Tacoma tailgate, unveils an arsenal. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, the fucking metal music starts shredding in the background. He opens up the case. He's got some type of M4 variant, like a military rifle, 30 round magazines. He's got nine millimeter handguns. He's got, what was that little five shooter? 38 special. 38 special. <laughs> he brings, even he, even just for the, I think just to show us how cool he was, he even brought his like military armored plated his vest. His plate armor and yeah. stuff. Yeah. So we carry that all to the range and we proceed just to. I'm Uncle Slam, and I'm here to teach people how to make ghosts. I'd never sh shot that style of like assault rifle. It was so fun, like just uh, holy. It's like it, yeah, like it's a cod gun, man. It looks, it's, you know, it's like a loadout gun. Uh, I shot an so SKS before, ten rounds. Yeah, which is similar. You can get them like the kit to make them look like that, but it's not the same gun. And this one was like legit. Like I was playing Call of Duty, but there was a real, real weapon of war in my hands. Yeah, dude, you, watching you shoot off 30 real quick, that was pretty badass. This is gonna help with our ghost problem. Absolutely. Yeah. Hey, worst case scenario, we'll make some more. That's fine. I just wanted to feel that. Now's the time. Dude, and then, dude, so we go we go back into the gun range, gun range or the office after we're done. We're checking everything in. And we're like, oh, they got some cool t shirts and stuff. So I'm like, we're looking at t shirts. And this guy who looks like. The, a, a, like He's a, a mercenary. Fucking, mercenary. He's a fucking mercenary. He's got the best. He's packing. He, uh,. You know, he's wearing the dark glasses. To keep up to date with all things alien theorist theorizing, follow us across social media on Twitter, Instagram, Patreon, and Facebook. For updates on new videos and content on YouTube, don't forget to click like and subscribe and hit that notifications button to keep those eyes on the skies with alien theorists theorizing.